deduct to cancel a portion of the sentence, and uh, it, it, it goes away. That's why Mr. Nipanyolo was constrained in the end when asked the pointed question, okay, this sentence, whichever one we are talking about, when does it expire? He had to say after all those things that it expires on the 11th of August. Now, <laughs> that means we have a situation where we have a, a sentence that expired on the 11th of August, but after three months, but it's a 15 month sentence. What is that? If, you, you, if it's either it was reduced, cancelled and extinguished and reduced to what? Which is really what the question Justice Lutu was asking. Okay, it's reduced, but to what? It's reduced to a three month sentence. And does a three month sentence, is it hit by section 47? <coughs> That is how advocate Dalimpo for the top advocate in the country, he beat Ngugaitobia on the debate about including Jacob Zuma into the MK candidate list for the upcoming general elections. So according to the court, the court has granted, uh, I'm going to read it, having heard counsel for the parties and having read papers filed of record the following order is made the application for leave to appeal is granted the appeal succeeds the decision of the electoral commission of 28 march 2024 in terms of which the electoral commission upheld dr matopola's objection to the second applicant's candidacy uh, that is mr zuma is set aside and substituted with the following the objection is hereby dismissed no order is made as to cost so it is signed as you can see there so mr zuma is the president of the mk and can lead this country again according to all the rules and regulations another victory another dollar another rent for the mk another vote please don't forget to like subscribe and thank you for watching cheers i don't know i think it was nine thousand people benefited from the remission but mr zuma's benefit must be delayed by five years it doesn't work like that he benefited the mere fact that he walked home to Gaza on that day meant he benefited on the 11th of august and that benefit covers everything to do with that sentence it covers section 47, it's, it covers the fact that, as the, the lady correctly put it, he was not on parole where he has to go to the parole officer and so on and so on. He was a free person like myself, like my learned friend, like my learned friend. Yeah, and what troubles me with uh, Mr. Nugaitovi's uh, preferred interpretation is that he wants this court to hold Mr. Zuma to consequences of a sentence, yes. right, that effectively does not apply to him. Absolutely. That's, that's that, what that the problem is.